In this video, I will show you how to get back Internet Explorer in Windows 10 or 11. So let's jump straight into it. So as you may be aware on Windows 10 and 11, Internet Explorer has been replaced by Microsoft Edge. So for myself, I've actually reinstalled Internet Explorer on this PC. I'm running Windows 10, but you'll see if I come down to the search box down here and type Internet Explorer, that I do have the app for yourself. If you actually try and do this, nothing's gonna come up. So to actually go ahead and get this back, what you're gonna want to do is open up your control panel first. So to do that, go ahead and search for your control panel and click on the control panel app underneath best match. So that's gonna go ahead and open up a screen like this. And from here, you're gonna to want to click onto programs or it might say programs and features, but you wanna click onto that first of all. And underneath programs and features, you should see an option called turn windows features on or off. So if you click onto this, it's going to load up a window like this. And from here, you're going to see Internet Explorer in this list. So you can see that's here. You can see mine's ticked, but yours is going to be unticked. So what you want to do is go ahead and take the box and then press OK. And any changes you make, you just want to go ahead and restart your PC. So once you've gone ahead and done that, that's going to reinstall Internet Explorer. What you can then do is come back down to the search box in the bottom left hand corner. And when you next go ahead and search for Internet Explorer, you will see the app has now been successfully installed. So once you've gone ahead and done this, you'll be able to choose Internet Explorer instead of Microsoft Edge. So that's how to go ahead and get Internet Explorer back on a Windows 10 or 11 PC or laptop. I hope this tutorial did help you out today. And if it did, I would really appreciate it if you was to consider dropping down below the video, leaving a like and also subscribing to the channel. With that being said, I just want to take a minute. Thank you guys for watching this tutorial and I will see you in the next video.